Welcome back. My name is Zane. Today we'll be talking about Lisk. And Lisk is your gateway into the blockchain. You know, Lisk is a blockchain um, application platform. They make blockchain accessible by creating a, uh, a world in which everyone benefits from this technology. So what is blockchain? What is Lisk? You know, so making blockchain accessible. You know, Lisk sets itself the goal to make blockchain technology accessible for a future in which everyone benefits from it. We empower developers with a software development kit from blockchain applications that are working on a interoperability solution to let everyone seamlessly uses them on our platform. Fascinating. So guys, this is Alcoin Disrupts. Now remember, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell to to be notified whenever we release new videos and i've created some fantastic videos i recommend you checking out this video on ren that's really fascinating and hedera hashgraph we're also on twitter if you guys want to follow us but let's get back to lisk because that's that's primarily what we're what we're researching today so what is lisk what are the applications you can build on their platform so this is a a list community is working on a multiple blockchain application developed with the lisk SDK, which is basically their kit, you know, it's it's their development kit. That's a list, um, Lisk, uh, Deo, and um, that is also the Fit Market Lisk Tickering or Ticketing Collabor Collaborancer Collaborancer Collaborancer. Jeez, that's a tricky word. Anyway, you can demo these. You can demo these and you can also go deeper. So the official Lisk wallet, before blockchain can achieve its full potential, it needs to gain mass adoption. Lisk is determined to, to solve this problem by becoming an easy, secure gateway to this technology by offering cryptocurrency wallets for desktops and mobile. That's fascinating. So you can also check this out and download it if you do so, please. Now, guys, I must, I must let you know, I'm not a financial advisor. And this is not financial advice. This video is for entertainment purposes and for educational purposes as well. But if you guys are interested in this, it's the way you can download the applications for the wallet. It's available Windows, Mac, uh, iOS, Android, Linux. Let's go on. It's quite fascinating. So since 20, 2016, 3 million transactions sent. And uh, since... Um, 250,000 accounts have been created with at least one transaction. Fascinating. So hold Lisk and Bitcoin on this wallet at the moment. So Lisk is an account for your first step benefiting from blockchain technology. With your account, you can securely hold, hold Lisk and uh, BTC as well as send, receive and, uh, and request uh, said cryptocurrency both on desktop and mobile. Fascinating. So vote for delegates. Um, delegates on the desktop version of the list you're able to participate in the delegated proof-of-stake consensus algorithm vote for your favorite delegates and uh, take part in the decision process of which delegates uh, secure the list blockchain so monitor the list blockchain this is cool so we include a fully featured uh, list uh, blockchain explorer into the desk desktop version of the of the list you can explore the decentralized network, monitor in a wallet, block block or transaction, and uh, inspect delegates. Fascinating. So they give you a list of things that you get with each wallet, whether it's a desktop or a mobile. But obviously, it'd be if you've got one wallet, you can have it on your desktop and your mobile at the same time. So isn't that quite good? So current price for Lisk is uh, four US dollars, or four point three US dollars. And as you can see, supply is actually, it's not an insane amount, but it's also not extremely low. Certainly in supply, 127 million and 143 million for total supply. But a max supply, there's no number for a max supply. So we'll have to look into that a bit more. And uh, if you guys are wondering, like recently, if it's been doing really well, I'd say if your cryptocurrency can double since the start of the year, it's been doing really well. And Lisk is more than doubled because at the start of this at this year it was one point one dollar, one point one dollar. It's now four point three dollars. It's 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 more than it's more than three x. So if you invested at the start of this year, if you invested ten thousand pounds 
for ten thousand US dollars, you would probably have forty thousand US dollars right now. But remember to pay your taxes. <laughs> that's just that's just me being silly. Of course, you shouldn't pay your taxes. <laughs> Again, I'm I'm just joking, guys. You should always pay your pay your taxes, and that's another thing as well. If you guys are like, because a lot of people out there don't even think you have to pay taxes for cryptocurrencies, you should. You have to. It's a capital gain. It's the it's the same as as stocks and shares. If you gain capital while investing, you have to pay um, tax. And sometimes you have to pay tax regardless if you if you cash out or not. If you sold your cryptocurrency, you have to pay tax regardless if you cash out or not. If you sold it and you intend to to resell it. To, to reinvest it in something else, you have to report this. It's the law, especially in the United in the United States and the United Kingdom. It works similarly to 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 capital gain. It's capital gain, guys. Have to pay tax on capital gain. Now, I'm not here to educate you on capital gain. All I gotta say is that I'm not a financial advisor, and this is not financial advice. This is just me being educational. Yeah, I like to be educational. Let's get into it again. So let's is a blockchain that aims to be most developer friendly on the planet by using the ever so popular JavaScript. It is seeking mass adoption. Guys, if you don't know, JavaScript is probably probably one of the most popular programming languages in the world, except for HTML, because HTML, everything is built on HTML. JavaScript is what makes everything more interactive and animation-like and friendly. And CSS just makes it all look pretty. So all of these pretty things you're seeing, that's CSS. But the animation style, when I hover and you see these animation moving, these are all JavaScript. You know, you can also use other programming language for similar for similar interactive behavior. But point is JavaScript is a well used programming language. Most of the most developers who are like advanced developers, they, they know how to code in JavaScript. It's it's essential for most front-end development jobs or back-end development jobs as well. I mean, front-end development jobs, most developers focus on HTML and CSS, but JavaScript is always a great bonus. And then you got back-end developers, they focus on like server-related things. I'm not going to get into it because this is about Lisk. So yeah, it's uh, it's a blockchain platform that wants to allow developers to create, customize, and then distribute dApps dApps or decentralized applications. The primary coding language is JavaScript, which is one of the most common languages around the world. By choosing JavaScript, Lisk aims to attract an army of developers who can code their own dApps. And that's true. The amount of people that can use, that can code in JavaScript is unprecedented to most development um, coding language. JavaScript is widely used with almost everyone. It's well known, it's one of the most popular it's one of the most popular languages, if not the most popular language, you know? So I'm just letting you guys know this because it means a lot of people are gonna be creating applications using it, using JavaScript. And it's good that they that they chose JavaScript as their language to develop on their website, on their platform. It's great, it's such a good idea. Couldn't have chosen a better language. So these dApps are built on side chains so that they don't um, slow the main network and that's good. You want to keep your network fluid, responsive, and fast without slowing it down. But you also want to create dApps for your platform. Put it on a side chain. It's fascinating. So a side chain is a separate blockchain that is used to carry out transactions without recording them on the main chain. Side chains are designed to free up main blockchains from having to process dozens of small transactions, and is often dis de de described as a uh, scaling solution. So how does the, the side chain works? This, um, think of it as a, um, as a main chain, like a tree trunk. Side chains are the branches connected to the trunks. And the, and the trunk of the tree is obviously the main blockchain, but don't affect it. The side chain doesn't affect it. The side chain um, development keeps the, keeps the main chain from being weighed down. And uh, the, it protects the, the main chain from any bugs that might affect a side chain. So by separating your development um, process, you actually reduce the risk of, of crashing or or compromising the entire blockchain system. It's it's clever, it's really clever, you know? It's fascinating and at the same time, they're, con they're kind of connected. So who created Lisk? Max 
Core Deck and um, Oliver Beddows founded Lisk in 2016. Before that, they were working on an open source blockchain application platform called Crypty or Crypty. So though similar in concept to Lisk, they realized there was too many um, constraints with the platform constraints. If you're a developer, then oof, you get that joke. With the uh, platform to, to achieve the kind of um, scale they wanted, so they broke off and created Lisk. A brief history. Lisk is uh, founded as a fork from a similar crypto, Crypty. Uh, 2017 March, they raised 14,000 Bitcoin from an ICO. Very good, very good. So that's in Bitcoin, and who knows? Maybe it's still in Bitcoin, which means that it's, wow. That's a lot of money right now, 14,000 Bitcoin. So brand re relaunch, and in, that was in February 2018, and in August 2018, the mainnet launch. So Lisk headquarters are in Zuck, Switzerland. So what's so special about it? Lisk, um, language. Lisk, uh, biggest selling point is that it's based in JavaScript, and that's a huge selling point. I can't explain to you guys just how much that uses. Anyone who's a supporter of Lisk or who's a programmer yourself or you know JavaScript, then you know what I'm talking about, how important it is to have JavaScript. <laughs> you know, it's, it's the best language to use for development when so many people know it, you know? And it's, um, I, I was actually learning learning JavaScript at one stage, and that's how easy it is to, to get involved in this. You, if you can learn JavaScript, then you can learn how to build apps on Lisk. Decentralized apps, by the way, guys, dApps. So those apps that we were talking about earlier, like these ones, yeah, you can use JavaScripts to build similar apps. Now that's pretty damn cool, if you ask me. So you remember like back in the early days, like iPhone just came out, 20, you know, when it, when it just came out, but years after it came out, like, 2009 2010 2011 when the when the world was blowing up with new apps everyone was creating new apps you know you remember what that was we were using c plus most developers were using c plus to um to create those apps for iphones and i think some developers are are still using c plus or c for dummies um there's a good book that's called c for dummies if you want to if you want to learn c language or c plus really good book um it's called c for dummies but it's it's essentially the same now we got a new platform to build application. And that's a decentralized web. It's a decentralized platforms that are coming out like Ethereum, Lisk, Cardano. They allow you to build applications just like that, how the iPhone allow you to build applications in the early days. So this is a good thing. I love this. So if you guys thought, oh, I want to get into programming, but I wanted a new thing to invest in. Not just I like build a mobile apps. You wanted a new thing. Here you go. Here's your opportunity. So... How is Lisk produced? The currency of Lisk network is the Lisk token. Uh, these tokens are mined like other types of cryptos. They are forged. That's because Lisk operates on a consensus protocol known as delegated proof of stake. Essentially, holders of Lisk vote for the people they want to validate blocks on the blockchain. The more Lisk you have, the more weight your vote has. The people who who receive the most votes become delegates and um, and are paid in Lisk for validating blocks. In total, there are 101 delegates at a time and uh, they can be replaced at any time if they don't perform well. <laughs> there you go. It's motivation to perform well. A key advantage of this system is that it's fast. Transactions can be validated in seconds, not minutes. Unlike Bitcoin proof of work, system lisk doesn't have to fix amount of total supply instead delegates will get fewer tokens over time for validating blocks that's interesting so licks <laughs> sorry licks um doesn't have a fixed amount of total uh of coins in supply instead delegates will get fewer tokens over time for validating blocks so essentially it will become more rarer um but can they mint more coin? That's that's my question. So how does a list token work? Well, this will be our final point that we'll be going on to. So Lisk is the fuel of the list network. It is used to reward delegates who validate blocks on the blockchain. It is also used for payment for any transactions that happens on the on the list blockchain. For example, a developer who wants to register a DAP, they create it. In the future, Lisk will be more crowdfunding um, cryptocurrency when someone uh, creates their own token and launches it, launches an ICO on the network. So what can you do with Lisk? 
and this can be used for transactions on the on the list blockchain network it can also be traded for other cryptocurrencies on several major exchanges the future the goal is that Lix would eventually be um, host loads of dApps a few are in development, but it's still early days. Lisk is counting on the flood of developers with the side chain development kits. Um, and given that it's it, it's they will get a lot of de developers because they're using JavaScript. Fantastic. I see great potential in Lisk. That's what I can say. The price is reasonable. The supply is reasonable. I see great potential in Lisk. Absolutely. I definitely see this 100x in. And at the end of this year, I can definitely see this thing hitting maybe, maybe even before the end of this year, sometime this year, this thing will hit maybe 10, 10 US dollars, but eventually it will 100x. That's, that's my belief. It's fascinating. So yeah. So yeah, they're, they're counting on the flow of developers to come in, whether it's our reliance on JavaScript will be blessing or, or curse remains to be seen. But I think reliance on JavaScript is absolutely fantastic. JavaScript has been one of the number one on programming language for years now. And that's not going to change anytime soon. It's not easy to create a new programming language. And it's definitely not easy to create one that's better than JavaScript. JavaScript has been being used since I was a boy. Since I was a boy, I remember seeing JavaScript on, on my little Samsung phones. On my Samsung phones samsung phones games i used to play games on my samsung phone and i remember seeing the javascript uh, logo being displayed javascript has been around for a long time and trust me it's it's not going away anytime soon so i i can't actually i wish i could show you guys what i what i'm saying but i remember seeing um javascript logo and it's kind of like a cup of tea kind of logo but I remember, I remember seeing, seeing, seeing the, seeing the logo, and um, and I never, never really forget it. But um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Hope you guys subscribe. Hope you guys leave a like. Um, can't find, can't find the, the thing to explain it to you guys. But maybe another time. Anyway, my point is JavaScript will be around for a long time to come, and it's it's good that Lisk are using it for their platform. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe. Share this video with a, with a friend if you think they need to learn about cryptocurrencies, especially Lisk. And uh, I'd recommend you guys checking out one of my newest videos, which is called Ren. It's been up. It's been out for two days, and it's already got over over five hundred views, and it's doing fascinating well. Ren. And I really enjoyed making this video because I learned so much, and everyone really enjoyed this video. So I think you guys will as well. So obviously subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay. Thank you for watching.